Okay, so in a world of internet people, right, you have a lot of skeptics who don't think you can make a living doing this shit, okay? First off, what do you think of the new setup? I designed this fucking arm thing here, I put the pop filter on, I don't even know if it's better, but comment below if you can tell a difference. Anyway, this is what happened. I went to a club the other day with my homies, we were shooting videos, you know, the ones that you see on my channel, and a girl decided to come up to me and just fucking ridicule me for 20 minutes for no fucking reason. She decided to come up to me, ask me, one, if I was doing a podcast. I don't know why she did that. Let me see. Is the mic here somewhere? Uh, that mic back there, you can kind of see it, I think. I was holding it in my hand. She's like, are you guys doing a podcast? I said, no. We're out in the club. I'm doing interviews. Would you like to be in an interview? She said, no. Fuck no. I can't do that. I said, oh, well, that's too bad. That's about it. That's all that I thought was going to happen. Then she begins to tell me that she was born and raised in the music industry. I said, well, that's great good for you i tried to end the conversation there but then she tells me i don't think youtuber is a real job because i told her i was a youtuber and then i say what all right whatever and then my buddy goes why do you say that she says because she grew up in the music industry and those are the people that uh, have real jobs or something like that she said i was selling myself short being a youtuber for some fucking reason now why did she say that I don't know, and why'd she decide to come up to me at a club and just start ridiculing me? I don't fucking know. I have this aura that I give off where women just seem to fucking hate me, and uh, I don't know how to control it. If you know how I can control it, comment below, because I don't fucking know. So she came, then she tells me that fucking, uh, she grew up on Prince and Michael Jackson, as if that fucking means anything. I said, what, what does that supposed to mean? She said, those are real musicians. She said something that they were real and I'm basically a loser for doing YouTube and I'm selling myself short. Okay, and I say, you think Michael Jackson was a good person? Tell that to the fucking kid he touched. Don't fucking tell that. Don't say he's a good person. Then she continues to go, fucking gerbil on about some bullshit telling me how my career is fucking bullshit. Then she tells me, I hope you get sued. Okay, but on top of that, on top of her telling me she hopes I get sued, she tells me she used to live in New York. I say, wow, that's great. This is how she said it. I lived in New York. I looked at her like, what the fuck am I supposed to do with that information? Then she tells me, this wouldn't fly in New York at the clubs in New York. I said, well, I lived in Harlem, New York, for about two for about a year, right? And uh, I was fine with it. That's where I started making videos. And then she said, I lived in Manhattan. It wouldn't fly in Manhattan. I said, motherfucker, Harlem is in Manhattan. What kind of fucking New Yorker are you where you don't know what the fuck is in where? Bunch of dummies, man. Listen, if you want to be a YouTuber, go for it. I think it's a real job because I'm putting in fucking work. I'm making videos. I'm filming all the time. This shit is a job. It's an easier job. I'm not going to lie to you, but it's a job nonetheless. Anyway, boys, go cop yourself some merch. Jada506shop.com. Link in the description. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.